this is Katie from my Space Studio creative team. Today I will show you how easily and quickly you can create a white background product photography and all this by using Canva. So if you're ready, open your Canva and let's do this. In this tutorial I'm going to create white background product photo for Amazon. So for this let's click on create a design button and choose custom size. Here I will choose the best dimensions for Amazon image, which will be 2000 on 2000 pixels. And when you choose your right dimensions, let's click on create new design button. And let's drag the product photo into the Canva. When your product photo appeared in Canva, let's increase it. For this, with left mouse button, just click on the borders and hold Alt key on your keyboard and drag by the borders. This will help us to enlarge the product from the center. And let's place product in the center of the canvas. When you found the best position for your product, let's get rid of the original background of the image. For this, select the product photo, click on edit photo button from the top menu bar and choose background remover. Canva will do all work for you and only in seconds you will get really great cutout of the product. Of course, we have some a little details to fix, but it will be very shortly. If you don't have a pro account of Canva or don't want to waste your time on creating a product white background image by your own, you can trust this task to professionals. For this, just visit myspacestudio.com. We provide a range of product editing and graphic design services. And be sure you will find something that works the best for your business goals. And let's come back to the Canva. To fix some of missing details of our product, let's click on this icon near background remover and it will open for us a background remover section which will allow us to restore some missing details. To restore missing details, just click on this icon which is named restore. You can increase or decrease the size of the brush and let's just paint over the areas that we want to come back on our photo. And when you're happy with the final results, just click on this arrow near background remover and you will come back to our image. Our next step will be adding a natural shadow for the product and there are some very useful techniques that you can watch in this tutorial where we shared how to create a natural shadow for your product by using elements section. In this tutorial I will show you another technique of creating a natural shadow for your product, especially if you have some complicated products. For this let's duplicate our product image, click Ctrl C and Ctrl V on your keyboard that will allow us to create a copy of the image we already have. When you created a copied image, we need a bit modify this. For this, let's click on the adjust section and play a bit with its brightness because as its shadow, it have to be very dark. Let's decrease brightness on 100%. Let's decrease contrast and highlights. Let's put shadows to the bottom and decrease our whites and blacks. Also, let's take all colors from the from this image. And basically, this is very good example <laughs> that you should not post anywhere because now we need to place this image under our beautiful product image. For this, select it, go into the position and click backward. And this image will automatically appear under our product image. Let's fix a bit its position. And now the most interesting part will start it because now it doesn't look like its original shadow. We need just to make a one little switch to make it look more realistic. So select our shadow image, click on edit photo button and choose blur. This will allow us to blur the, our current image and create a vision of a realistic shadow under the product. I will go with 60 points and when everything is done, we also need to decrease a bit our shadow layer. For this, click on this icon that is named transparency on the top menu bar and let's decrease the visibility of this layer to 40%. And our last step will be adding a bit catchy look to our product. For this, select the product image, go edit photo and choose adjust section and let's add a bit brightness a bit contrast and of course clarity to the product which will 
pop up all details of the product. And pretty much that's it. Only in few minutes we created a catchy product wide background photography that can be used for any of your goals and listed on Amazon, in social media or your personal website. If you really enjoyed this tutorial, please let us know with your thumb up under this video. And of course, don't forget to use MySpace Studio and check our free trial editing. Our creative team will take your product photos under control and provide you only with best results. For this, just jump into the description of this video, we placed all useful links for you. Thank you very much for watching this video till then, see you very soon, bye bye!